before we go into the skate park, guys, make sure you drop a fat thumbs up on this video because that Harley is extremely loud and any like will help us. And if you want a part two, so just like the video, right? Yeah. That was kind of confusing. Just like the video, that'd be cool. For some reason, people are still asking me if I've quit scootering. For some reason, people are still asking me if I don't scooter anymore. Guys, first of all, before you watch this video of me teaching my girlfriend how to scooter because I love it so much, I just wanna make this clear to you guys. I am never gonna quit scootering. I love scootering. I am not leaving the sport of scootering. I do it because I love it, and that's why you should do it as well. So if you guys ride scooters, you should do it because you love it, not because it turns into a job or not because you have to be a professional scooter rider. I'm just ranting on and on now, but guys, the main bottom line is I'm not quitting scootering. I'm not going anywhere. I'm staying in the scooter community I love it I love everyone in it but on a side note if you guys are new to scootering or you want to start scootering it's Christmas season you know people are gonna start asking for some gifts I got a little recommendation for you so this right here actually is my signature scooter it's a Tanner Fox X lucky scooter you guys can get a good look at that Ooh, look at the grip tape look at the grip tape lucky and then my signature of course super cheap reliable good-looking it's look at it I mean look at it it's sexy it's it's sexy it's the perfect beginner scooter if you guys want to pick up one of these there's a link in the description you can buy it from luckyscooters.com yeah enjoy the video of me teaching my girlfriend how to scooter ready I'll do a trick for you guys see so I didn't I hit my head on that I don't want to hit my head on the roof enjoy the video It's the day you've been waiting for. Here it's scooter. Which one do you want? This. Put that. All right, let's load it in the car. Time to load up the whips. Gonna go for a quick skate park session. What are you hoping you learn today? Kickflip. Kickflip? That's a good trick. It's one of my actually favorite scooter tricks. To be exact. Kickflip? Yeah, kickflips are really hard. Okay. Scooters. Especially because it's like a skateboarding trick. What about a kaboom? A kaboom? That's also very hard to do on a scooter because that is actually a trampoline trick. You want to try to name a scooter trick though? Come on, you should know this. One scooter trick. A bunny hop. There you go, okay, I count. Okay. Good morning guys, welcome back to another vlog. I uh, hope you guys are having an amazing day today. We're headed to the skate park by popular demand. You all asked that I teach Taylor how to scooter. Are you ready to learn how to scooter? Hell yeah, bro. All right, what's the, what's the goals today? What are you looking for? Um, I'm looking to try a kickflip 180. Okay. And a bunny hop swirl. All right, and Anything you're working towards in scootering, like any contests you're working coming up, anything, anything like that? Yeah, I can't talk about that on video. Dustin's gonna make the crucial trash run. Be careful of that one. That one, that yeah, one's all works, so bro. You gotta make it to that trash can without getting caught by the friendly giant. And he's done it, ladies and gentlemen. Straight into the recycling. We are officially caffeinated up right now, guys. We just got our drinks. Taylor got her coffee. Now she is officially ready to go learn how to scooter. I am really excited to film this video. Hop out the Prius. You already know. What's up guys, welcome back to another video. I am joined with my beautiful girlfriend, Taylor Alicia, right here at OB Skate Park and by popular demand. What are we doing today? We're scooting. We're scooting it up. We're scooting it up. As you guys know, I came from a scooter background before I did YouTube. I've never been a scooter rider. So you're gonna learn today. Let's get the scooters out. All right, we have the Tanner Fox signature deck, Tanner Fox signature wheels for my ride. And then for Taylor's ride, we got the T-Fox complete right there. Boom, she's looking fire. Going to start, 2 a.m. Got some mango high, choose a bag of chips. Rolling through the city and we hide behind the tents. And the Benzo got the swisher out the window. Then we, step, we get over here and we gotta warm up. We gotta get ready. You have to stretch? This is boot camp of scootering, Taylor. Right now? This is boot camp. You need a helmet. No. I'm okay. She got the coffee going, she got the sunnies, she got the little booty shorts. All right, you're feeling yourself today, I feel that. All right, that's cool. Mmm, there you go. You look like a dude. Hey, you look beautiful. You look nice and safe. Safety and number one pilot. We're gonna go over here and we're gonna teach her the basics of scootering, and then we're gonna get into this. Let's go, come on. This is uh, no joke, Taylor. A lot of people think scootering is just some joke sport, but. I don't know. This is, this is the real deal. This I is know actual, it's the real deal. This is actually not in the Olympics. It's not that cool, but it's it's a big deal to me. So first things first, we're gonna be getting really active, Taylor. Do you know that? Are you aware that we're gonna be going to the skate park? We're gonna be getting sweaty. We're gonna be working Why out. Why are we doing this for my eight months? Oh yeah, this is our eight months today. We're celebrating our eight months of dating and nine months of knowing each other. Perfect, awesome, cool. All right, ready? First thing, we gotta get some stretches going. Can't touch this. Can't touch this. Bro, I've been coming to the skate park since I was like four, and every time I come here, I talk to everyone here, and I'm sure they all see it. And so he purposely, like, that guy always been doing that. That's actually a very good start lesson to this uh, to this video. Very good start lesson. Everybody 
it hates you. If you were on a scooter, everyone in the skate park usually hates you. So that's why scooter riders are different. You gotta be why? different. You gotta why not care you? about the haters. I don't, it doesn't really make sense, I know, but everyone just doesn't like scooters. Like, just like a perfect example. It was a prime example. It was like Free literally bell. on video. It was the perfect example. Skaters and BMX riders, and everyone normally doesn't like scooter riders. So that was a good example. So you gotta listen. You gotta say have a hard head. One more time, I'm gonna say something. Don't say something, Taylor. That's another rule. You got, as a scooter rider, you have to take it. The I wanna go on the skate park, Taylor? Are you, are you getting stressed out? Yeah, I'm getting stressed. I'm gonna fight someone. It's unexplainable unless you're scooter riding and you've dealt with it, but I think you're ready. We got us some stretches going. We're good on the stretches. You learned a little thing or two about skaters. Good news is they all left. I honestly, am I surp I'm surprised at how they're even up right now, too. Cause it's like 10 in the morning. That's really early for skaters. Normally they wake up at like one. So first step is, uh, this is what we call a little bowl. We do bowl stuff in here. So I guess the first step to scootering is kind of like getting a feel for your style, kind of feeling where you are in the right sport. In. Uh, sure, let's just jump right in. Go ahead, jump right in. I'm very bad at this. I have not scooted in a very long time. We haven't even figured out your, how you, your stance. So come over here. Which way do you like standing? We should figure that out first as well. Oh. You like that? Uh, yeah. You like goofy? Good, you're goofy. Okay, now that we've established that, let's hit a drop in a little bigger one over there. A little bigger quarter. Come on, let's go over there. You just gotta drop in. Just like that, boom, easy. Careful. Good job. All right, Whoa. so that's easy. So we've covered a six inch quarter. Ready to head on inside? I can teach you about the pumping. I can teach you how to flare. I teach you how to grind. I teach you how to tail whip. Teach you how to bar spin. Teach you how to grind. Yeah, grind. Grind a little bit. Can't see my eyebrows. <laughs> <laughs> Can't touch this. It's just it's literal like skate park culture. Like People you just don't board. get it. Board? Like Dustin doesn't get it either. It's just skate park culture. Nice razors, guys. Thank you, man. I got them at Walmart. Tell you, I told you, it's like that every time. Oh, I'm telling you. Was he being sarcastic? Yeah, it's our razors. He knows that. <laughs> You're learning, Taylor. You're learning. Why hey, well, everyone so mean? So that's what you gotta say. Also, I teach you defense. So when this dog right here, this pit bull. He's just letting his pit bull like run free. That's why I'm saying it. Skate park culture, Taylor. I grew up at here. I know. I know how it works. So they just hate you? Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> pretty much. That's kind of how. That's kind of how being a YouTuber goes as well. Go for the bank. Okay. Want to send the bank? Want to go for a little bank action? It's not really me teaching. Oh, she's oh. just going for it. Oh no. Oh no. Slowly. <laughs> Slow, there you go. It's kind of me just telling her to do stuff and she'll just go for it. Let me actually give you a little bit of a constructive tip. So when you go down the bank, you want to bend your knees. You want to have a good stance going. So you, no, you did great. Wait for these people. Nice Walmart skateboard. <laughs> cool. Now that Taylor's learned how to go down the ramps, and she's kind of got a feel for the skate park, you know how the people treat you there. I think the next step is learning your first trick. We're gonna learn how to bunny hop. So all you gotta do, just like when you jump on your feet, you bend your knees and you jump. Just like that. So when you, hit, you stand on the scooter, hold on the bars, bend your knees and jump. Get it. Jump. Ooh, that was first try. First try. You don't even need to do it again. It's perfect. All right, now next trick. So the next trick we're gonna learn, a double flare. All right, so when you double flare, you're gonna wanna go up the ramp, you wanna pull back as hard as you can and tuck until you do two flips and then you land. All right, that's the next one, that's the next step. Or we could go pump yeah. in the bowl. You said I didn't Or we could go pump in the bowl, whichever one like sounds like more fun. Well, it's just something easy. Let's go do the pump in the bowl? Yeah. All right, that's cool. Taylor's not quite warmed up enough yet to drop into this kind of ramp. We're gonna crawl in there, teach her how to pump around a little bit. Just get a feel for the scooter a little more. You know, we gotta teach her, that's the whole goal is here, to teach her how to be a professional. So first you gotta learn your style, you gotta learn how to pump. You gotta feel out a little bit. Sound good? Um. Little bowl action. You got this, Taylor. Come on. You're at the skate park now. There ain't no being a little girl. You gotta drop in though. You can't just slide Come in. Come on, bro. I will drop in. I will bar spin in from like this. So next step, you're gonna learn how to pump. You know what that means? No. So you're gonna wanna go up the ramp and you kinda pump your legs and you kinda get momentum as you go around the pockets of these ramps. I don't know. That sounds really confusing, but just do I'm gonna go and then you go after me. Okay. And we'll just see how it goes. Just like that. And then you can go. Do that. And then you just do that. Okay. No. 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 Hit one little pocket, alright? I'll push you. I'm gonna push you. Can't do it. Buddy. Stay there, stay there, stay there. I'm pumping. I'm gonna push you. Come here, come here. No. All right, you gotta pump. Okay. Don't, she's riding muffin. She's not even riding ski. Zoom in on the feet. Oh, oh no. Muffin. It's called muffin. That's what it's called. Aaron Hill, shout out you, bro. What Hold on, all right? I'm gonna push you. I'm nervous. Go around the corner. I don't like it. Too scary? Let me do it myself. All right, you do it yourself. Can't touch this. Can you see me pump? Yeah, that was really good. <laughs> 
Thanks. You're pumping. Oh Taylor, honestly, has got a lot more skill than I thought she'd have. She definitely is getting the hang of it. Nice, you're pumping. She's kind of just, she's kind of just bobbing as she goes up the ramp, but I guess it counts as pumping. There you go, pump, pump. Yeah, yeah, there you go. Do you even ride, bro? Do I even ride? All right, you want to get out now? You got to crawl out of there. Run. Run, run, run. Run. Good job. <laughs> oh. Last thing. Now that we made it up from the bowl, I think you have to drop into that. Think you could try? I didn't have to do that. Taylor, I really need a thumbnail, though. It's kind of big. Oh, there, like the, the, We could just go like this. And then you kind of just... I can't do both. Just, just slide down and then get on it. It'll count. Yeah, that's I'm how you drop. In. I'm a good teacher, right? Yeah. Oh, she did it. Look. Can't touch this. Look. Behind you, behind you. I was pumping. You're not paying attention. All right, come out here, babe. I can't. Give me this. All right, now grab that. I can't. Grab this. I'll pull you out. She doesn't need me. She doesn't need me. She's a pro. All right. There's your whip. Think now that Taylor has learned how to scoot her to her complete fullest extent. I think we can get a few little doubles clips. That was okay. We can redo it for you if you want. Mine was clean. You think we should redo it? Maybe. Because yours was like spotless. Mine was a little sketchy. Mine was clean. It was a little sketchy. I really do agree with you. I think everyone here is getting a little jealous of our Razor scooters. All right, so we're uh, currently having a little bit of a white girl problem. She forgot her coffee inside the skate park. She would not continue. So we had to come out of the skate park. She acquired the coffee. She learned a lot of good tricks though. We've been here for about 20 minutes. See, my girlfriend had a scooter, went extremely well. We got bunny hops, we got doubles clips. What's wrong? Tastes a little iffy. Tastes a little iffy. Think a skater might have spit in it. Did you? Why would I spit in your drink, Taylor? I am here to teach you how to be a professional scooter rider. You don't. You don't though. I was playing you this whole time. What's your name? Tony He's a skateboarder. Caught ya. All right, that is gonna conclude teaching my girlfriend how to scooter. If you guys enjoyed, don't forget to drop a fat thumbs up on this video. If we should do a part two, maybe I could teach her some other stuff. How did you think it went? Final thoughts, scootering, skate parks. What do you think? Lincoln bio. Lincoln bio? Yeah. But what did you think about the experience of scootering at the skate park? I loved it. You liked it? It was yeah, fun? Anyways, really guys, fun. don't forget, this is my signature scooter deck. I got signature scooter wheels, and this is my signature scooter complete. If you guys want to get any of these parts, if you're new to scootering, you just want to start out scooting, this is a great beginner scooter. Uh, check it out. First link is in the description, as always, and yeah. Is this mine now? Do girls scooter? Do girls scooter? Excuse me, do you scooter? No. You don't? Okay, so not a lot of girls scooter. Some do. You can be a scooter rider. Taylor, great job today. Thanks, Taylor. Hey, guess what? High five. Back from the skate park, now we are headed up to Oceanside and Dustin is gonna show us around a little bit. It's gonna be fun. I decided to continue this vlog. I was just gonna end it at the skate park, but I'm gonna bring you guys with me. Oh, Taylor, look at that Louis backpack. Gosh dang. You wanna race, buddy? Trying to get beat? Trying to race? I'll do no launch control. That's not fair. There was a car in front of me. I want a rematch. There was a car in front of me. You know what really sucked? We actually can't do a redo because there's more cars in front of us, so I just have to take that L. Car is so loud. I love it. Wow. Car noises. Hey, we found a little McLaren, buddy. Guys, this is crazy. In the 11 months I've owned this car, I never run into supercars on the freeway like other supercars. Dude, he's old. He's not gonna race you, he's old. He's not doing Come on, bruh. Look at the little mirror, though. We're at TJ's warehouse right now, and I got great news, guys. My turbo kit just came in from FRS. We're gonna head in, unbox it, and then I'm going to Arizona this week, and then we're gonna install it when I come home from that. So hopefully, my FRS will have a turbo in the next, like, two weeks. This is behind the scenes of TJ's life. I just dropped your turbo kit. It broke. Sorry, dude. Oh, sh gotta go, then. I don't even like you, so if my turbo kit's broken, I don't wanna be here. Yeah, no, it's, like, destroyed. Oh, sh no, yeah, I don't even like your YouTube no. channel sucks. Yeah. Your video's all terrible. Okay, all jokes aside, I forgot you had a puppy, and I didn't right. know it was here. Oh no, Taylor's in love. This is Blue. His name is Blue, yeah. 
Damn, well, it's good to see you, TJ. I know, dude. How's it Good, good, good. Okay, I'm gonna pet his dog and, and not film right now, and then I'm gonna film my turbo kit. Oh my gosh, hello, Blue. How you doing, bro? You gonna get him a car? Um, yeah, but before you get to see that, you can follow his Instagram at ablueslife. Hey Blue, you officially got a pop tag. You got a pop tag, Blue. What do you gotta do about it? All right, Blue. So, now that you've got you got the plug, what's next? What's next on the agenda? Does he eat your tires and stuff? No, but he chews all my shoes. You gotta take him on rides in the cars, bro. You, got, you, gotta, you gotta hold him on Yeezys. Oh, no. There it is. Box has seen better days. This oh. man, dude, <laughs> he's about to kill himself. Rip away. All right, guys, I'm not gonna film a whole lot of this because it's probably not that cool for you guys. But we're putting this on the FRS, hopefully in the next two weeks. So look forward to that. It's gonna be a lot of fun. We're gonna do it all here in TJ's warehouse. If you're not caught up with what's going on, I ordered a turbo kit about four or five days ago for my FRS. Basically, that means it's gonna be a lot faster. It's gonna be a lot more fun. And we get to do like car build videos and they're gonna teach me how to install it. So it finally came into TJ's warehouse. And then after I go to Arizona, we are gonna install it. So that's gonna be a super fun process if you guys are looking forward to that. So yeah, I'm trying not to act like I know about all this stuff because I really don't. I'm gonna learn. That's why I'm just kind of like, oh, cool. But I'll learn what it is. What's that weigh? Like, 50 pounds? Oh, at least 200. Uh, this is not 200 pounds. <laughs> that is gonna do it for today's vlog. I hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to cop one of your T-Fox scooters or a Tanner Fox signature deck. These are two different items. So if you like our professional scooter rider, you get in there, you're gonna get my signature deck or you can just get the complete. So either one, link in the description. Guys, look forward, more scooter videos coming soon. I'm telling you guys, as soon as I build my ramp, that is a huge thing I'm waiting on. As soon as my ramp in my warehouse is done, we are gonna be riding every day, me and my friends all the time. So hope you enjoyed. Let's roll the outro. Or no, sorry, let's roll the Fox cam. Hope you enjoyed that great video. Make sure to leave a like, um, subscribe, share with your friends, and let's roll the outro. I wish you were so good.